going to do, we're going to uh, cut a thread on a piece of pipe. We've prepared the pipe well, nice square cut, deburred. Um, the first thing we need to do is make sure we've got our PPE, steel toe cap boots because it is uh, heavy work. I'm going to wear gloves, the other option is barrier cream. Um, first thing we need to do using a flat file is make a leading edge by chamfering the edge of the pipe so the uh, dies can start threading. Good, there's a nice chamfer on there. Then uh, what we need to do is uh, apply some cutting compound onto the pipe. We use cutting compound to uh, lubricate the threads as they're being cut and it also uh, protects the dies and uh, makes sure they last a long time. We're going to use the stocks and dies and um, it's important that um, when we put them together that we get them in the right order. The ratchet side is the first thing that goes over the pipe so the die is closest to you. We start cutting the thread by placing it over the pipe and with the bar at about three o'clock and just applying a bit of pressure on the end of the dies, we will push down and start to cut the thread. You will feel once the thread starts cutting and you will also see the swarf start to appear. Then you can use two hands and then carry on with a downward motion. It's a lot easier to use the dies this way rather than trying to pull on them in an upright position. After you've been down about five or six times, you will uh, notice that the swarf is starting to curl away into the dies. It's very important that we start to then clean the thread out. And then pulling the stopper out and changing the direction of the ratchet, we will now go backwards, clearing the threads. Then once they're cleared, again, we can then put the direction so the arrow is pointing down and start cutting our thread again. We keep going until the pipe appears at the last tooth of the die, and that means our thread will be long enough then to go into our fitting. Now we can carefully unwind the die from the pipe. And there we have a lovely tapered joint. Oh, my God.